Welcome back to The Factor Uncensored. You've seen my next guest here on The Factor many times. He'll be back to doing what he does best Saturday, stand-up comedy. Comedian Juan Villarreal is starring in Comedy Night at Activo Houston. Tickets are now on sale. You need a few bucks. It's not that expensive. Only $25 to get in the door. Let's bring in Juan to talk about it. Juan, good to see you. Nice you to see you. You are at Activo? Is that per Club I'm Activo saying? on okay. the south side of Houston. Got it. And, dude, you are in demand all over. You are traveling like crazy in this country. Yeah. Well, we just did uh, the Latin Queens and Comedy Kings. Uh -huh. and, uh, we now, were you a king? Yeah. That's what we need to yeah, know. Because you're our king here on the factory. Yeah, because they, they've been asking me to do something like that, but I didn't want to be a target and people, oh, he thinks he's a king and this <laughs> and that, whatever. But after 31 years and the you know, accolades that I accomplished and the, man, the, all the obstacles that I toppled, I'm like, yeah. You can call me a king. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. I'll take it. I'm, I'm 56. I see. I ain't. I ain't. You know what I mean? Exactly. Hey, call me king Bile next peasant. week. I'll be, a, yeah, I'll, be, I'll be a president. Yeah, I might be. A, I might be a president too. Like, <laughs> they give you a shot to be a king. You take it. Like, you know, right. Now you just heard the guys talking about the restaurant you had. Oh thing. yeah, man. <laughs> Interesting to say. Yeah. <laughs> when I mean, you food know, food grifters come in you know, and take advantage got, to get free food. I got. Uh, I. I got cousins that used to like take a little roach with them or something like that and they would have to meet they'd be like hey there's a roach here and and the, and the port owners and the and the, the staff oh my god and they're mortified they're, yeah and they wouldn't even just get the meal comp they would get another meal you know what i mean so i i, I feel their pain man i would don't I would, don't take Juan's advice on this no don't He's do just that telling you stories. that's a felony now <laughs> so what can people expect at uh activo when you perform there Man, Isaiah, after I got off stage and then I started getting a whole bunch of congratulations from comics and promoters and people that, you know, club owners and stuff. So I'm not going to be able to be doing shows like this no more. They're going to start doing bigger venues and uh -huh. bigger things. So this is like going to be a little bit of the old one, just a fun one. My comedy is uh -huh. fun. So it's just going to be fun. The club is not really designed for comedy, but they redecorated stuff. They moved stuff for us. And George and his team, they're like, man, we're going to have it. It's going to be a comedy club atmosphere. So I'm, ex I'm excited and I, you know, I'm at that level now where like, I don't know if you saw the movie, The Last Dragon, when it's like, who's the master? Who's the master? <laughs> I'm at that point now where like, I am, <laughs> right, I Bruce am, Lee bro. Roy. Yeah, <laughs> Bruce Lee, like, I really am. Quick, give us the details before we go. Man, it's this Saturday. The show starts at eight o'clock. I have a couple other comics coming with me. Club Activio, it's 9120 Winkler. It's, you know, Monroe, 45 in Monroe. And Southside, you've always wanted me to come and show some love. Well, here I come. And ticket sales are going well. Thank y'all for supporting. And uh, we're going to have fun. He's on the way. But Isaiah, first of all, thank you so much for letting me do this. Oh, no I, problem I, I truly, truly appreciate it. Thank you so much. Still ahead.